What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Aviation VPS. Today, I have a three model unboxing for you guys. This is from Prairie Diecast. They are my go to retailer. Due to the limited supply they do have, it's kind of hard sometimes to get the models you want. But I do really like them. You can get great deals. But yeah, so I'm really excited for this unboxing. We do have two special aircraft in this unboxing, but let's get into it. So the first aircraft we have here is the third release NG model Southwest 737-800. I do have two of the second releases, but here is a third release just because you can never have enough Southwest aircraft. And our next aircraft here is another Southwest plane, and we have the Southwest 737-700 in the Maryland 1 livery with the new tail. So I'm really excited for this one. I want to get the Missouri one also, and then Colorado one when it comes out. So really excited for that model. And then we have one of the microfiber cloths. And then something I definitely purposely waited on at first, but got it for 40 bucks. This is the Delta A321 in the Thank You livery. Really cool livery. And just that box art is unbelievable. So yeah, guys, here are the three models we have today. And without more talking, let's get straight into it. Alrighty, guys, so we got changed the setting for some more light. I finally got a light, so my airport's not dark as can be anymore. But yeah, so let's start out with the Delta A321 Thank You livery. So uh, here have the box on the front with right Airbus A321-200. Dedicated to the world's best employees and customers, we have the computer-generated image, the Thank You titles, Delta registration N391DN, NG models. So here's the side of the box top of the box, and the back of the box. Let's get it open here. Awesome. Oh, so we do have a little foam layer. No collector's card. I guess that's, this was released before that, but sweet. So here is the model itself. Fun fact, this is my first A321 by NG models. So definitely excited for this one. Let's open it up. And here is our model, looking fabulous. Not too sure about this foam, it was just kind of sitting on top. I don't, I don't know what the story is with that. Anyways, so here is our model. Let's get this review going. There's a tripod here. And yeah, so here is the aircraft. Starting off at the nose cone, we have the Delta World's Best Employees logos. I don't know. Let me get this to focus better. If I come down here. Alright. Yeah, there we go. So, uh, World's Best Employee titles on the front. Uh, one boarding door, Delta titles. Emergency exit. Then we have the landing gear also, sorry. Antenna on the front. Then we have the thank you titles. And then we have our engines, winglets. Wi-Fi dome, more antennas, and the tail. And we'll get a look from the front here. This is looking beautiful. I absolutely love this model. I almost bought the Gemini one, and I'm so glad I didn't, because I'm sure this NG one is just superior. But definitely glad I got this model, and I would definitely recommend getting it before it's gone if you haven't already. So solid model by NG Models, and let's move on to the next one. Alrighty, guys, and here we have our next model, which I am... Extremely excited for. Uh, this has always been one of my favorite uh, Southwest special liveries. And I hope it sticks around for a while on 700 because I think it looks great. Anyways, but here we have our box art, which would flow with the other three releases. They did the blue nose in the Canyon Blue Tail and then just the normal Canyon Blue Tail. But here's our box art, 737-700, computer-generated image with a great background. Southwest, the registration, N214WN. NG Maryland 1, side of the box, and the top of the box, and there's the back. So let's get into it. Crack it open here. No collector's card. Lame. So here is the model. Let's crack it open. And there she is. Alrighty, guys. Looking really nice. Let's get into it. Closer look here. So here we have the model. Wow, this is a great model. 
Start off right there, we have the Maryland 1 titles with the Yale 1 boarding door and that southwest heart. We have the landing gear down there, antenna on the bottom, the Maryland flag protruding across the whole aircraft. We have the white engines with the gray winglets, and they're painted on red light there. There we have our middle door, antenna on top, Wi-Fi dome split by the flag, looking really cool. Registration, southwest tail, rear exit, and the stabilizers. We'll get a look from the other side here. Doesn't that look cool? Just that view down the middle. Love that. We also have our exit lines on the wings. This is a really good model by NG Models. I would definitely recommend picking it up if you haven't. We have our red landing gear and the bottom of the aircraft, which is something I forgot to do with the Delta. Here is the bottom of the aircraft. So yes, guys. That is the Southwest Maryland 1. And then... Um, we have the Southwest 737-800 in the new livery. Um, there's your box. It would connect with the other non switch scimitar one, but classic box. I'm not going to go into detail on this because most of you guys have already seen this model before, probably by someone else. It's just, you know, kind of old news. This one should, yes. This one has a collector's card. Sweet. Let's crack it open here and get the model out. Alrighty, guys. Looking good. Alright, so here is the model. Looks a little dark, to be honest. Definitely darker than the first release. <laughs> That's. It's kind of weird. Not by much, but. It's definitely odd to see. Especially by NG. But uh, starting from nose cone, we have a very faded nose cone compared to the other two releases. Southwest heart, our landing gear, Southwest titles, uh, southwest.com on the engines, split scimitar, emergency exit lines, our two doors, Wi-Fi dome, registration and tail. We get a look down the middle of the aircraft here. Great details on the top of the aircraft. Then here is the look from the bottom. Really solid model by NG Models. Uh, this does conclude this unboxing. I really hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, yeah, we should have an airport update coming up pretty soon. So be looking forward to that. And until next time, see ya.